Well, the final tally of votes cast during this general election have now been made official by Cameron County Commissioners. And that means the county could have a new judge in just a few days. Channel 5's Daisy Martinez is in the Cameron County Newsroom with more. County Commissioners canvassed the votes today, officially declaring the winners in each of their respective races. Cameron County Judge-elect Eddie Trevino has been waiting since the spring to take office, and in just a matter of days, he will. Elections Administrator Remy Garza says the total of 93,716 votes marks the highest number of votes ever in an election for Cameron County. That means 48% of registered voters made it to the polls. In past years, Election Day has recorded the highest number of voters in a single day. This year, Garza tells us two-thirds of voters cast their vote early during the two-week period prior to Election Day. There were also about 3,400 mail-in ballots this year. Now with the election canvassed, all winners will begin their term come January 1st. County Judge-elect Eddie Trevino is the exception. Since he is taking over for current Judge Pete Sepulveda, who was appointed, not elected, into office, Trevino can begin his term immediately. Sepulveda was appointed to the seat by Secretary of State Carlos Cascos, who vacated the judge's seat to take the state office. Garza says now Trevino just has to submit a written oath stating he didn't coerce anyone to vote for him, take the oath of office administered by a judge, and submit a $100,000 bond as required for any elected official who will deal with money or things of value. Uh, your county clerk, uh, your county treasurer, your county tax assessor, even the elections administrator has to uh, submit a bond. Uh, but primarily, like the county judge, is that there are things that his office engages in where a bond is necessary, some form of security, that if anything were to go wrong, uh, the people of Cameron County would have a recourse in order to recoup their loss. Garza tells us he hopes voter turnout will continue in big numbers in future elections. He'd like to reach the 50% mark in voter turnout. There were no major glitches in this election, despite the unprecedented number of voters turning out at the polls. Looking forward, Garza says the county could see an electronic voting system in as soon as a year. As for Judge-elect Eddie Trevino, he says he'll be sworn in on the 23rd. From the Cameron County Newsroom, Daisy Martinez, Channel 5 News at 6.